this video we're going to show you how to make this carrot that goes with our finger puppet bunnies. Be sure to check out our video on our finger puppet bunnies and um, check out the pattern link that we'll give you down below. But this makes such a fun toy to take with you and to travel and all the little bunnies fit, fit right in this and keeps them all together and it just they just turn out darling and I hope this video helps you now for my carrot I've cut two of the orange fit patterns and two of the line this little carrot is a lot simpler than you may think we take our quarter circles and we're gonna put one side uh, lining and the orange part right sides together and we're going to sandwich in the one side of the zipper so that the tab is on the outside for the orange because we want the carrot to be orange and we want to access to that tab then with those sides together we're just going to sew a quarter of an inch and I've held the zipper back um, and we've marked it on the pattern because this top part's going to gather and it'll be harder to open the zipper in the gathered area. Now, I had to get the right color of orange zipper, I had to buy a longer zipper, which is not a problem. I'm going to cut this off and then I'm going to whip stitch uh, stitches back and forth to make a zipper stop where I want the zipper to end. Okay, then the, you do it on the other side. You're going to put the two sides together and keep this straight edge aligned and the top aligned and the zipper is sandwiched in between and to make sure that both sides the oranges are together and then we're going to sew a quarter of an inch seam on that edge and I've kept the top of the zipper uh, out like this so that it's not showing and if it's hard to get past the zipper tab I'll unzip it so that I get an exact quarter inch all the way up. Now I've got my zipper in and I have put a layer of batting, thin polyester bonded batting in between the lining and the outside of the carrot. Then I'm going to bring the carrot section and the batting together, both battings and the lining and I'm just going to sew quarter of an inch across this uh, straight edge. Now I've turned it and I'm starting to just turn up under this edge so each little side is just a quarter of an inch turned under and you can make it really nice and neat. Then I'm just going to top stitch on top so of that. So that uh, closed if you want. This works fine because I'm going to gather it and it won't really show. Now with the zipper open, I just machine sewed these little lines like what car carrots have. They're kind of parallel to this outside part. Just little indentions and that gives it that carrot look. Now I can close it up and start to hand gather with double thread knotted at the end and I'm going to gather this very edge and the trick is you really want big gathers because then the hole this is a lot of fabric to close and we want the hole at the top to be fa fairly small so these are probably at least an inch if not larger um, basting stitches okay and I'm going to go all the way around. Now on the inside I took each of the tops of the edges of this fold and also cut it with another thread and pulled it in tight so that the inside is is closed up and then I did it on the outside too. I went around and around catching the top edges of these folds just to really secure that and probably did it about four times with matching thread. Now I've taken a large rickrack. You can use ribbon, whatever kind of look you want. And I've taken six inch lengths 
folded them in half and then just with the machine you can do it by hand too I just attached the ends down at one end just to make them look cool and they look really neat now I'm going to poke this down in the hole that is left from gathering and then hand stitch now once I poked in. it down and stitched it I went ahead and started stitching the pieces of rickrack just down a little bit to cover that hole and then just catch it the tops of those gathers with the edges of the rickrack and that kind of helped it spread a little bit and it looks way cool and it helps secure you want it. to download this free pattern on our website we'll give you the link down below but it comes with these cute little finger puppets and your carrot that we just showed you and I hope this video has helped